is a very easy breakfast that the three of us love so much and I also like to serve this with some ghee and some homemade jam. This jam is so easy to make. I'm just going to warm up some frozen strawberries. I'm going to add some maple syrup and some chia seed and it needs to be in the refrigerator so once it is chilled and cold I like to put this in the refrigerator and it's good about to up to a week or so but it's always gone before that Hello guys, welcome back and if you are new here, my name is Noemi and for today I'm going to have so many exciting things that I want to get done and I'm going to start with all these herbs. I've got this from a friend, she has a very amazing garden and she makes all kinds of sorts of oils and um, so she shared some of the herbs with me. So I'm going to start to work with this now. There's an amazing book on the Amazon that I want to order and basically that will explain how to use the herbs and also I want to incorporate this into my cleaning. So look out for my next video because I'm working on now on the cleaning video where I'm going to use some herbs. hang these herbs out of the sunlight it's not going to be completely dark but at least it's not exposed to the direct sunshine so I can have the nicest color and flavor in them and after it's dry I can put them into jars so one of my subscribers had a genius suggestion she mentioned there's a jar that is exists that has an amber color so guess what i already ordered that from amazon and <clears throat> i only, since i have this open shelf you guys if you remember if you saw that video we put up the shelves on uh, the side of the kitchen so we can extend our pantry items so and I only need just a few of that for sensitive items like tea. So whatever it doesn't fit in my drawer, I am going to use these like for this tea. So this color is supposed to be helping with the UVI that is taking away the flavor, the coloring, uh, coloring the color <laughs> and the taste from the food. So I'm super excited to transfer some of my favorite teas into that so that way I can keep it out on the shelf, the items that I use every single day. The other question that I'm getting a lot, where do I get these lids? I ordered them from Amazon and the reason I like it because it's one piece and the other one that it comes with, it just in two pieces. So it's great for cleaning but it gets rusty and it has PBA 
that they used on the inside so it doesn't matter it's made from metal because it still has the toxic thing in there so with that this is so much easier to use the downside of that is that it soaks all the flavor in so for example if i put garlic in one of the jar if you're going to use that lid on a smoothie on the next day <laughs> you're gonna have a fun day to drink that yeah we don't like pickled flavored um, smoothies <laughs> so for that um, what I find I just got two of this lid to use only for smoothies so that way we can tell it apart that this is the top for my husband's smoothie but even further and as I was doing the research on that I actually find something that I was looking for a very long time and that is a stainless steel one so this is a stainless steel one doesn't absorb uh, the smell and so it doesn't ruin the taste for your drink because I'm about to make some infused water in this one and this lid will help me to <laughs> eliminate the garlic flavor, pickle flavor, whatever we used that uh, lid before. Because if you store that lid, eventually the smell goes out but soon as you put it on the top of the jar and store it like that it somehow it comes back so it's really deeply <laughs> absorbed in there so with um the storage that i use for storage i just let it as is i already have those white ones and it works well i just keep reusing them so it doesn't make any changes so it came in this little box i ordered them off of amazon but um this is how they came in I don't know how many pieces was i think it was 10 maybe 8 or 10. i'm going to link it down below for you guys if you are on the search for a stainless steel lid because it's truly just really made my day that way because it solved the problem that um, it was ruining my drinks and i think it looks really nice i i rather to have metal than plastic but at the time when i was buying that that was the only one so i'm just going to keep using these and for the everyday items like smoothie, I'm going to use the stainless steel ones. to drink tea however sometimes i just want to drink something else and this is the infused water is something that helps me with generally drinking liquid because if i only drink water i feel like i'm drowning in a pool <laughs> so it doesn't really encouraging me to drink uh, as much as i need to but that way when i have some mild taste because these have a very mild taste and has a fun color i'm just more encouraged to drink more not to mention all those benefits that the herbs and the fruits brings to this drink For next, I'm going to chop up some chives and I love to use this top of the food that I'm about to serve. It's excellent in soups, even just to sprinkle some on top of the rice or some omelette and it's just going to make it more appetizing. Guys, chickens are the best therapy ever. <laughs> they are so much fun. Come here. Pok, 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 pok. Pok, pok, pok. Pok, pok, pok. Come on. See ya. See ya. See ya. But I have some apples. How do you like the apples? Do you want to try that? Puk, puk. <laughs> uh, uh. 
since it was kind of sunny and dry weather the chives got really dry over a few hours and I was able to put it into a jar for next I have some store brought dried carrots but next time I'm going to make at home Nice, do you wanna help me? Okay. Here's a picture. B1 on oh, both sides. Oh, do you wanna bring in the screwdriver to the garage? That's like 50 different kinds of screws. <laughs> I'm serious. And all have different heads. Can I see? Look. Two. 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 Oh, it, it. oh, why? That, that, that's what we need. So, I think if you just put it together without the instruction, it's easier. Wait, I need A to an A. Uh. So this. But it doesn't say a thing. I don't know. Before you school it, okay? Yep. You know I can bring it in here. No, no hammer. <laughs> oh, there you go. Haha. <laughs> I tried to pull this. It's like a little ladder. <laughs> Whatever you say, one is done. Like I said, I could always bring in the oh, hammer. There you go. No, no hammer. <laughs> Okay, bring in the hammer, I don't care. Okay. <laughs> no, no, I'm just kidding. The reason I got this organizer, so first of all, I wanted to put this into the garage where I have the washing machine so I can hang the clothes there to get dry them. But I find that, that I might going to have a better use for this as we enter to our home. We can hang our clothes. And the main reason is I wanted to get rid of that drying rack that I had all the time in the hall. So it was in our way. We couldn't pass by it, but we needed something where we can dry our towels. But I figured out if I put on hangers all the towels at night, it will work just as fine and also I can organize the coats as we enter. So far it, it's been working really well. So what I do with the towels, I just use this hanger and I just put it on like that. So it looks like a coat <laughs> and I can just hang it here for the night so that way I don't have to keep it in the bathroom. And by the way, I am going to remove this hook hooks from the back. But until we decide that this is gonna be a permanent spot, I wanna keep it there. But once we know this, I'm going to take this off. Okay, so I think we're going to put some shoes here. And I was thinking, since I have this leftover, this is from Ikea because I'm getting a lot of questions about this. This is what I have in my kitchen drawers. And I like it because it's see-through. So I just have this, this big piece. I'm going to cut it in half and I'm just going to put it on this rack area so that way it's all the dirt is not going to fall into the other shoe. for watching guys and I will have other organizing videos coming up but for next 
watch out for the video that is coming very soon and it's going to be a clean with me video where i'm going to include my herbs as well thank you so much for watching and i will see you guys soon bye